Hi there and welcome or welcome back to my channel in this update for Turn and Burn. Now in this project I have had seven products to work on. They are one-time use items, deluxe samples, minis, you know, things that are easy to use up. And I am getting a little low on that. <laughs> In the beginning of the year, I had so many small things uh, that I've been trying to use up and I have successfully done so and I do have a lot left, but I feel like I have so many projects, so I feel like I need to lower that number. <laughs> so I'm going to work on five next month, but let's see what I have been finishing and what is rolling over to the next month. So the first thing that I had for last month was I want a hippopotamus for Christmas by Lush. This was a bath bomb. I love the color of the water. It became like a dark lavender. It was very, very nice. And it's also one of their cheaper bath bombs as well. So that's good. And even though it wasn't one of their, you know, spectacular or many like multicolored bath bombs, it was really... It was really relaxing. It was just that lavender oozing out of that bath bomb and yeah, it was a very nice and relaxing moment. The next thing is a foot bath bomb shaped like a foot. It's by Sense Beauty and I think it's really cute. And I was planning on having it in a foot bath, but I don't really have like a container big enough <laughs> to make it a foot bath container. Um, so I'd have to borrow that. So, um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know when I will do that. So I hope I can get it done this month. But uh, yeah, we'll see. Either I'll do that or I'll use it together with another bath bomb or something like it. I don't know. But this is staying. For the third product, we have the Kix Miracle Worker face mask. And uh, I used it today. And I thought just by squeezing it that it was like a gel consistency or something like that. It turned out to be like a white clay mask, but it was so much in here and I didn't know if they, you know, if I should just use part of it, but it said to apply the mask. So I guess I could use all of it. So I used all of it, but then it didn't dry up, you know, some parts dried up a little bit, but not all of it. So. I don't know if it's supposed to be that way. It felt very different from other masks. So I would have liked that like clarification of how to use it. Uh, Next up, we have the hemp seed oil from Glam of Sweden. This is a sheet mask for the face. I liked it. It's a face mask. I don't know what else to say about it. Then we have the shower gel from Rituals. I've used it once or twice, but I have not used it up. I do have quite a bit of shower gels to go through in my collection and I have another project called work out for that pan. So every time I work out, I get to, you know, use one of those items. So every time I work out, I use that instead of the other ones that I have in other projects. So uh, sometimes they are slow going, which when I think about it is kind of nice because that means I'm working out a lot. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to try to finish this until next time. Then we have a mini perfume, the Flower Bomb, by Victor and Rolf. This is how the packaging looked, and this is the perfume, which is totally empty. I love this perfume. It is really, really nice. Maybe if I ever, ever get through my perfumes, I would buy this, um, but I'd have to look at the price because... You know, there are so many nice, cheap things that I feel like if something is expensive and I really like it, I'm like, yeah, but I like cheap things too, so let's go for the cheaper option. <laughs> so I don't know if I would actually buy it, but I do think it was a really, really nice scent. And for the last product, we have a sample from Yves Rocher. This is the Anti-Age Global Complete Anti-Aging Care Day. <laughs> day cream looked like this and I've used it I liked it but honestly I feel like most creams do the same thing so I don't know what to say about it 
So that means I finished five out of the seven products. I am only going to use five, like I said, uh, going forward. So I need three additional products. And I thought, well, why not roll in another perfume samples now when we finish that one? So I have one here. Looks like this. And it's called Yes I Am Pink First um, from Cacharel. Sacharel? I don't know. But yeah, I'm going to whoop. Going to try to finish this one. I'm also going to use this glow sheet mask, vitamin C from the body shop. I'm thinking since I'm having the serum, vitamin C serum from the same brand, I would try this out together with that before it's empty. So yeah, this is another sheet mask and I'm going to use a peel off foot mask. Now I've used this one before. Well, not this one, but the same thing <laughs> from the same brand and everything. Um, and this is really interesting. You use it and after a few weeks, you, the dead skin just comes off your feet and it's like you can peel off the skin and it's so gross. At the same time, it makes your feet so soft. It feels so good afterwards. And I thought I would do this before my brother's wedding, which is in a month when I record this. And, um, yeah, I don't want to do it too late, <laughs> so I'm going to do it very soon, I think. So those are the five products I'm going to be working with. Those three and the shower gel and the foot bath bomb. <laughs> so I am really looking forward to using all of these products. I hope you enjoy this video. I hope you'll have an amazing evening that I'll see you next time. Bye.